Hey, what's up, guys? As I said from the beginning, most of you don't know me. And that's because this is my business page, and most of you don't know me personally. Because I set up this page specifically for business. Now, those who do know me know that nine times out of ten, given my history, given my history, this business video is going to be about something that you do online and you got to get somebody else to do it or something like that. Network marketing, MLM, gifting, something, right? Something that you all have seen and you're accustomed to. I'm sure, you know, some of you who already know me are expecting that pitch. Well, guess what? This is your lucky day. It ain't happening. All right, so let me just break it down. For the last, I say, 25 years, I've done everything I could possibly do to not go get a job. Nothing illegal or immoral, just business. Making businesses, creating businesses, joining businesses, starting businesses. You know the drill. Because I'm a professional musician, I'm a Grammy Award winning songwriter, performer, producer, writer, the whole deal. And you can't, you can't keep a job very long if every time you start a job and two months later somebody calls you and says, I need you to go with me on the road, right? You don't get to keep that job by constantly going in and saying, hey, I need to be off for a week, <laughs> right? They, they just, employers don't like that. I don't take it personally. I, they got a business to run. But um, because I'm good at sales, they hire me. I can't think of, I can, maybe twice I've applied for a job because I'm selling when I'm getting a job and they know it. So I always get hired. But in the course of that 25 years, I've always involved myself with some form of network marketing, MLM, something of that nature because it's easy to do and you do it from home, I thought. What I found is that's the hardest business in the world to try to start because you have to not only get people who are motivated to do a business like that with you you got to find those people and then once you get them you spend the rest of the time trying to keep those people here are the statistics 98% of people who started online marketing, MLM, network marketing business fail. And they fail quickly. And those that don't fail quickly fail long term. There's very few people who have maintained their standard of living. And that standard changes because sometimes you get in some MLMs, it's like being in a cult. They basically make you go get a good car and all that kind of stuff just so you can look good, right? But to maintain your standard of living, I don't know anybody that's been in the one company they started from the beginning and are still in it. I don't know one. Now, there are those that started with Amway and they're still with Amway and they're making millions of dollars, but that was a long, hard road. And they're still, to this day, I don't care if they're 80 years old, they're still every day shaking hands with somebody or fist bumping or whatever they're doing right now because for every one person that makes you stay at ten thousand dollars a month which is the, the special number for everybody to this day one hundred twenty thousand dollars a year is still really good money in order to maintain ten thousand a month you have to bring in about a thousand people because every day, hundreds fall off at the back because they're not making any money. That's just the truth. Now, people are going to hate on me for this, but that's just the truth. You know it. All you got to do is look it up. Now, you can start any business you want. Now, let's, let's talk about other businesses I've been in. I've been in gifting businesses since 1998. That shows you how long ago that's been. And I don't care if they, you call it a susu, juju, fufu. No matter what you call it, it's gifting. 
and gifting is a gray area business and in a lot of not even a business it's an activity it's a gray area activity and for the most part the ones that people are doing right now are illegal and eventually somebody's going to go to jail and when that person gets popped everybody's going down because i don't care if you get your friends and family you are going to roll on them to stay out of jail freedom is a great motivator now this whole video is not about bashing anything do whatever you want to do i'm just telling you i've done it all there is nothing i have not done so when you come to me with this new idea it ain't new cryptocurrency is not new it's just another form of fiat what's the difference US dollar crypto dollar no difference because <laughs> they're both backed by nothing they're backed by your action your movement your work your energy so who is the real who is the real uh, what's the real value the real value is you people and the line is don't trade time for dollars well you got no choice <laughs> you know you got no choice there's only three things you can trade for dollars time people and product or units if you will well the business that I'm in I'm trading units units for dollars as you can see I'm sitting at home I'm not going out and doing anything that requires me to make money however when I do go and when I tell you I go it's just go somewhere talk for five ten minutes and then the next time go somewhere wait on somebody to do some work for me then go somewhere else wait on somebody to do some work for me and after I'm done with that, I come home. It's not online, it's not network marketing, not MLM, none of that stuff. But let me tell you that today, I'm closing on a deal. I should probably end up being Friday. But if I close this deal, which was just a meeting I had at a business yesterday that was going to be like a five minute little talk, give them a card, move on, turned into a full scale tour of their company. And now it could end up being my first big client. And that big client is not going to take me any more time than it takes me to have this conversation with you. That big client is going to probably pay me. Let's see. They need 2000 a week. I'm probably going to broker that deal with the supplier. And that's going to make me probably minimum a dollar per. Minimum. Okay. So that's 2000 a week. That's eight grand a month. Every month as long as that business is in business. So I'm gonna do everything I can to make sure they stay in business, right? Consulting, the whole deal. Now, again, it started with the meeting yesterday. It was gonna be a three minute talk, 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 card, I'll talk to you soon. Turned into a half hour tour of their plant we discuss the options and if I close this deal on Friday or Monday at the latest that'll be my client at about two grand a week and guess what else to service them I don't even leave my house matter of fact I don't really have to think about it because all I do then is just schedule when do you need the product oh every Thursday by what time okay and how many do you need great okay and then my supplier packs ships drops off 
takes away the old product, goes back to what they do, and I'm sitting at home waiting on my check every week. And that's one claim. So what happens if I get three? And let's say the other two are very, very small. Let's say the other two are, they need 100 a week. So that's 200 a week. And let's say I'm making five bucks per. That's another $1,000 a week. Two plus one is three. Then that's $12,000 a month for as long as all three of those businesses stay in business. Now the two small ones, I have to go take them their product, sit in my car and wait on the forklift driver to unload my truck. Anything I need to take from them, I get the forklift driver to load my truck. And all I need is 15 pounds of pressure on my arm to strap it down. I just kind of gave you a hint about what I do. But I'm going to give you three more hints about what I do. Hint number one, everything around me. That gate, this chair, this necklace, this necklace, this hat. The patch that's on the hat, my watch, my bracelet, the cigar, the shingles on the roof, the roof, everything. The boards on the the boards on the deck, the grill, the grill cover, the chair I'm sitting in, <laughs> this headpiece, the laptop I'm using to talk to you with, the earring in my ear, everything touches this product. Have you guessed yet? If you've guessed, put it in the comment. Second thing. Every, not every, 85% of every business and every industry in the world either needs this product or is trying to get rid of this product for both. Got it yet? If you get it, put it in the comment. And thirdly, which should be the final guess, and if you don't get it this time, you, this business is probably not for you because it's not sexy enough. Third one is this. 45%, 45 of all lumber that's milled in the United States of America goes towards making this product or repairing this product. Now, you don't get this one. This ain't sexy enough for you. Well, if you figured it out, then you know what it is. And I can send you some information on how to take the training so you can hit the ground running. Again, I bought this training two weeks ago. It took me a week to take the training. I'm not finished, but it took me a week to get it. And I'm gonna keep circling back around doing it over and over again. But again, it took me a week to, to do it. It took me a day and a half to virtually change my life with just a, a little meeting and phone call. And if it happens and I pick up two more clients in the same area, because all these clients are always right on top of each other. So if I get two more clients in the same area, I'll be at over $120,000 a year in a week. No uplines, no downlines, no sidelines, no meetings, no coffee talks, no SEO, no Facebook, no nothing. And then you say, well, why are you having this video link? Makes good sense, yep. Why? Why aren't you just keeping this to yourself? Because it's so underserved and is invisible. Oh, did I mention? 95% of the product I'm going to get and that I've already set up to get is going to be free. Free. Oh, did I mention that nine, not 100% of the product 
I don't warehouse. I don't have any employees. I don't have any of that. And virtually all I'm paying for every day is a little bit of gas. Oh, a pen and a pad. If you're interested, comment that you're interested. Anything other than that, I'm just going to delete it anyway. So if you're interested, comment you're interested. If you got questions, ask questions. And I'll get you the information so you can finally get out of the real rat race. One rat race is the job. The real rat race is trying to not have a job. But this, this is the simplest biz ever. Period. With that said, I'm going to finish my cigar and enjoy this beautiful, beautiful day. It was 78 degrees in Minneapolis yesterday. Today, it's about 71. Doesn't get any better than that. All the leaves are changing, falling off the trees. Just beautiful. Just beautiful. So, enjoy the rest of your day. Think about it. If you're interested, reach out to me. If not, no problem. No harm, no foul. Because this money is getting made with or without you. Just to keep it blunt. Have a great day. Talk to you soon. G is out. Peace.